He went right for him through the Amaterasu! How? Hi everyone and welcome back to another Naruto reaction. Before we begin, as always, thank you to the patrons on Patreon. If you want to join us on Patreon, the link is in the description. Go check it out for early access to our footage and exclusive content like filler episodes of movies that are only on Patreon. If you're watching this on YouTube, please subscribe to this channel. Also subscribe to the ton of other channels that we have, which are all within the link in the description. Last but not least, check out our merchandise, which is also within the link in the description. Like this video, comment down below, and with all that being said, let's get started with this reaction. You're making all of that up! It can't be. Your jokes aren't funny. They know the story of Itachi. Everything I said about Itachi is true. He died for Sasuke. And for the hidden leaf village as well. Wow, we missed it. I don't know how Naruto's gonna take this. If what you say is true, and Sasuke knows it, then why would he ever help the Akatsuki? I would think he'd return to the Hidden Leaf to carry on Itachi's will. You all assume that you know his true feelings, but you couldn't be more in the dark. He's the real thing, a true Avenger. You Damn. made him that way, didn't you? Kind of. Sasuke chose this path all on his own. It is true, it was all on his own accord. You're a liar! I took a gamble on whether he would take on Itachi's will or seek revenge against the Hidden Leaf. He chose revenge. He chose vengeance. That means he is one of my kind. Sasuke's goal now is to wreak vengeance upon the Hidden Leaf for what they did to Itachi and to the entire Uchiha clan. Mm. Rightfully so. Why did he decide to choose revenge? It couldn't be helped. It's a curse that has been passed down through the ages. A curse wow. of hatred that began generations ago with the father of all shinobi, the sage of the six paths. What is he talking about? The first Rinnegan holder? But that's nothing but a myth. The Rinnegan was simply a random mutation. That's all. But myths are often based on the truth. The sage of the six paths taught Minshu and tried to foster world peace. But his end came before he fulfilled his dream. The sage bequeathed his will to his two children. The older son had been born with the sage's eyes, granting him chakra powers. He knew strength was necessary for peace. The younger son had been born with the gift of the sage's body, granting him stamina and physical energy. He knew love was necessary for peace. Together they're a great combo, but they probably fought each other. On his deathbed, the sage chose a single successor. His decision created the eternal curse of hatred that has continued for generations. Wow. Yin and Yang. The sage decided to choose not the older brother who sought strength, but the younger brother who sought love and made the second son his successor. The firstborn who had long expected to follow in his father's footsteps. He put him in the moon? Could not accept this decision. Filled with rage, he declared war on his younger brother. Even as time passed, the descendants of the two brothers continued to battle. The family tree. The descendants of the older brother came to be known as the Uchiha. Oh my gosh. And the descendants of the younger brother were called the Senju. Jeez. <laughs> it goes so far back. As an Uchiha, my battle with the first Okage was destined to occur. This may be only our second meeting. But I can tell that you hold the Senju's will of fire within you. He does, and love. I can see the first Hokage enduring within you. Even in death, he lives on. He whom I so admired, yet was my rival. And the man I Dang. hated most. Now it's Naruto versus Sasuke. It's been passed on. Senju and Uchiha, the will of fire and hatred. Naruto and Sasuke. You are just the next in line to be chosen by destiny. He has to break the curse. The Uchiha clan is cursed with a destiny of vengeance. Sasuke has shouldered the entire burden of the Uchiha's hatred and intends to strike deep into the world with that curse. That hate is his most powerful weapon. That is Sasuke's ninja way. And love is the source of Naruto's. It's the universe seeking balance. What I was trying to say is that the universe is always seeking balance and Sasuke and Naruto are the embodiment of the lineage of the Sage of Six Paths. So as much as we'd like to think these two have free will, it seems like this is all destiny. The Raikage has armor of lightning style. Mm. 
Dang. Seismic tossed Sasuke into the ground. And this guy is totally out from the Susanoo. So that's the right Kage Shinobi Taijutsu. There's no way Sasuke could have survived that. Guess we didn't need reinforcements after all. <gasps> oh, the Susanoo protected him. That's crazy. He's so lucky. <laughs> He's such a formidable force now. Oh. So that's the Mangekyo Sharingan. <laughs> Mangekyo Sharingan. Oh, he just transformed into a Super Saiyan too. No one has ever survived the Mega Bomb before. Not until right now. Geniuses like him are extremely rare. Sasuke Uchiha, he's a stubborn one. Dude, the Mangekyo Sharingan pattern looks so crazy on Sasuke's eyes. How long can he maintain it? Is that the Mangekyo Sharingan? The legend. That's why Lord Rakage ramped himself up even more. He's going to counter with teleportation jutsu. <gasps> I love the electricity and his hair standing up. You know. Maybe I'm too vulnerable to lightning style. My body is too numb now to liquefy properly. <laughs> Sugetsu was leaking into the floor. He's so useless now. It's just Sasuke left. Bring it, boy. Damn. You know what that means. He's losing vision. He's giving it his all. <laughs> he dodged that too. That's crazy. The Amaterasu. Oh, he's oh. gonna get caught in it. Nice. A shield of black flames. If you can't keep up, then use a shield that can't be touched. He manipulated the black flames. He's even more proficient with the black flames than Itachi. Dang. This is the craziest game of chess. Don't underestimate the right Kage. He went right for him through the Amaterasu. Don't, don't. How? Oh. Oh my gosh. Only one eye is still working. Got a send. Mm, I can't believe he got involved. This is this is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> That's enough, you two. Oh, that was sick. Oh, you samurai, stay back. This is a problem for the shinobi world. The way he walked no in there. Need for samurai to become casualties. Thank you, Lord Kazekage. Why do you interfere, Kazekage? Your answer will determine your punishment. If you had continued with your attack, the black flames would have further injured you. Really? How's the Raikage still standing? You great question. I wish to speak to Sasuke Uchiha. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> he really <laughs> sacrificed his arm. Hurry and stop the bleeding. Then I'm going after Sasuke again. Bro just cut his arm off, bro. <laughs> That's so, so crazy. Mentally determined. His left eye ignites the Amaterasu, and his right eye can change the chakra form of the black flames. I'm sure of it. Perhaps this Sasuke truly did capture B. It's such a mystery what happened to B. Your eyes are still as they were in the past. Both of us possess the exact same eyes. Mm. Cold and lifeless. Eyes that seek revenge against all those who made you so lonely. Eyes that burn to see all of them dead. But Gata changed. Gata now embodies the symbol that's on his forehead, which means love. I have come to realize that making vengeance one's bread of life does not resolve anything. It's not too late for you. Don't withdraw into your own world obsessed with hatred, or you won't be able to return. If I were to return, what is there for me? Forget it, Gara. Good He's question. A criminal. He's not like you. Plus, the Raikage and others harmed by the Akatsuki won't stay silent. After attacking the Five Kage Summit, he's wanted internationally. Just face it, this guy has no future. Those things were said about Gara as well. You and I are quite alike. We both walked through the darkness of this world. So your eyes should pick up even the faintest glimmer of light in the past, or even at this moment. So poetic. I shut my eyes a long time ago. The things I seek now lie only in the darkness. Damn, that's he, deep. He's trying to talk sense into him. He's the only one who could understand. Sasuke is like his previous self, and he resonates so closely with that. He empathizes a lot. You're the Kazekage. Mm. Don't let your feelings interfere. Yes. Mm. Oh, no. Oh, no. Dude. Naruto. One day you will probably end up fighting Sasuke again. Or rather, I'll throw Sasuke at you. 
I'll have Sasuke validate the existence of the Uchiha. Sasuke isn't just your toy, you know? You think you can make Sasuke have a change of heart like you did Nagato? To control others, you must possess the ability to manipulate the darkness in their souls. Nagato just happened to be easily influenced. That's all. So was Gara then? Gara was so tough too, right? Mm hmm Never compare yourself to Nagato! His methods were different than mine, but he truly wanted peace. But you, you're different. <laughs> no doubt. Master manipulator. I love that line. No doubt. <laughs> That's really your goal? To validate the existence of the Uchiha? Why collect the tailed beasts? Just what do you want? Well, if I wanted anything, it would be to be a complete form. What do you mean by that? I'll explain it at a more appropriate time and place. What the hell does he mean? I have no idea. He wants to incorporate the beasts into himself, maybe? It was fun chatting with you guys. Later. And just like that, he's gone. Sasuke, no! I love how he stands there and the sand does everything. You block my Inferno style well, I'm impressed. Your ultimate defense is in good shape. The Kazekage is freaking amazing. Found him. Donzo's there too. I've got to let Sasuke know right away. Except there are very powerful chakras all around us. It seems there's a sensory type ninja among our enemies. They're sure to reach this place at some point. For now, do nothing. When they arrive, we'll simply slip out of it. Chaos. Stop whispering amongst yourselves. I am a sensory type too. I know the enemy has found this place. But you three are not to make a single move. We wow. should deal with the enemy. It's like a game of chess within a game of chess within a game of chess. It's so layered. Yeah, everybody's just looking over each other's shoulders. You done yet, Z? A little longer, sir. I'll join you, sand guys. First strikes mine. Kale style, laser circus, secret red technique, I'm the triad. <laughs> Did they make a puppet out of Sasori? It looked oh, like him. It is Sasori. Maybe it was one of his original puppets. Holy shit. It's everyone versus Sasuke now. This guy's a legend, even though he's become so evil. He's in a very dark place, that's for sure. <gasps> the Susano has manifested itself. I've got an ultimate defense even greater than yours. Uh-oh, this doesn't look good. Was this what he wanted to test? <laughs> they didn't even know about this. Sasuke's chakra, it's so different now. It's too cold. What it's ominous. The power of darkness. <sighs> that gave me chills. A power that only those who have awakened the manga Kyo in both eyes can achieve. This is the third power. The Susanoo. Whoa, that thing is so epic. I love the contouring in Sasuke's eyes to depict how evil he is. And I still can't believe the Raikage took the Amaterasu to the arm and then he was like, all right, screw it. I'm going to chop this thing off, slices it off, and then continues about his day like nothing freaking happened. But obviously the best scene in this entire episode was the face-off between Gara and Sasuke. That dialogue that took place between them, not only does it go so far back, but it's a very deep conversation. And I just really love how certain things were implanted into the show and into to the characters and into us as the viewers so early on. Just when you think the story can't get any more complex, we get proven wrong by the writers. That being said, we'll see you guys on the next exciting episode. Thank you so much for tuning in. Stay tuned and peace out. Bye!